This is Eric Moad with Mother.com. Let's take a look at a stock here and we are showing almost 28 years of monthly data. And what I want to focus on here in this video is how we can use the RSI and not only to consider price analysis. Now here is an example where we can see a major low in price in 2009 now just from looking at this there's no way we can draw a trend line connecting let's say this low and where the stock is trading here in other words there's no direct trend line we can draw a trend line like that which has no relationship to this area where the stock is trading we can draw another trend line let's say somewhere here Again, no relationship with price there. We can draw another trend line. Maybe something like this. Again, doesn't give us a good indication of any relationship between this point and this point. And then we can draw another trend line. Let's say something like that. The point is we really don't have a direct connection between this major low in 09 and where the stock is trading right now. Now, there's a way we can draw this as an example. For example, we can use a hyperbolic line connecting here and where we see recent lows. So we can see from this line, let's say, if the stock was to break below this trend line, that becomes a major sell signal. And that in itself can be a valid way to look at this because it connects the lows here and this intraday low there and the intraday lows here so this line we can say in a way is one way we can connect this major low and where the stock is trading right now now that's the price analysis if we take a look at the RSI the RSI gives us a more direct relationship the low here corresponds with this RSI low a major low in early 09 what I'm going to do is draw a trend line like that. It connects the lows here in 2012, early 2013. And we can see here that the stock is coming to a level of support or break in the current market environment. So here we can see a good example where the RSI is giving us a more direct relationship between a major low and where prices are trading and more importantly it is suggesting that this is a critical area in the chart so the RSI suggesting something critical could happen here because we can clearly see a break of this trend line would be a major break because this trend line is more than nine years old and we can also see that support on this level would be indication of a major low short term indicating prices could have a chance of moving higher so we can see that the, using the rsi gives us a more timely view of what is going on in the stock keep in mind if we go to the three year three year monthly look what we see here is now we can see another view if the stock was to break below the monthly closing low in December, which is a 325.04, that would be a major breakdown. Also would be coinciding with the RSI primary trend line we saw from the long term monthly view would also coincide with the RSI moving to fresh multi-year lows and would also coincide with the MACD or at least one of the MACDs moving to multi-year lows. Again, another example why the RSI is an important tool in our analysis. Eric Mwadith, mother.com. As always, good luck, peace and blessings. E-R-C-S.